Tatiana McFadden is a champion both on and off the track. She was born with spina bifida and sent to a Russian orphanage where she spent her first six years crawling around without a wheelchair. In 1994, Debbie McFadden, the commissioner for the Administration on Developmental Disabilities, visited the orphanage and decided to adopt Tatiana and raise her in the U.S. I think that my past really has made me a strong, strong woman. I've been through all, of, all the hardships. With a fierce will to succeed, Tatiana channeled her energy into sports and fell in love with wheelchair racing. But it turned out that she had to fight as hard as she trained for the right to compete. She was not allowed to race alongside other student athletes. So Tatiana sued the state of Maryland for the right of disabled athletes to participate in high school sports. She got them to pass the Fitness and Athletic Equity Act for students with disabilities. We weren't asking for much. We didn't sue for any money. Uh, we just sued for the right for people with disabilities to try out for sports and to participate in the sports. She started a trend that has continued to spread. <laughs> Meanwhile, Tatiana kept right on winning at sports. <laughs> She was the youngest member of the U.S. track and field team at the Athens Paralympics, where she won a silver and a bronze medal. At the Beijing Paralympics four years later, she took home four medals, three silver and a bronze. She holds multiple U.S. track and field records, finished first in both the 2009 Chicago Marathon and the 2010 New York Marathon and is now training for this summer's London Paralympics. Off the track, she continues to advocate. I wasn't doing this for me, I was doing this for others. People with disabilities should be included from a very young age because we're not any different. For her championship efforts on and off the track, Access Living is proud to present Tatiana McFadden with its 2012 Lead On Award.